Wow! PFG family, man, we are finally back with another dope ass video. Like always, go ahead and smack that subscribe button and don't forget to like the video on the way in. Now, I'm actually just leaving out of the uh, the office. I had a little conference call to handle this morning, but it's all good, man. We handled all our business. Now it's time to have some fun. So let's go ahead and start the episode off with, of course, an outfit check. Now, we got on something simple right now, but we will get pretty clean here after a bit. Now, we'll start from head to toe. Of course, we got on that throwback wrap his jersey of course you know so we, we we had to pay respect to the legend man and then we went ahead and got on the slim fit jeans i think these are actually from h&m bro like a lot of people sleep on h&m i don't know why but hey i'll be in there and then of course we got on those retro fives man nothing too crazy nothing too crazy but let's go ahead and get into it now i know you guys saw the title of the video bro y'all asked for it man y'all asked for it. everything y'all asked for i must deliver so yes we actually do have a date bro we got a date to go on so of course we got to get clean man so we on our way up to the gucci store but before we head that way i gotta go ahead and do the premiere of the new bins that we purchased i think it was like two episodes ago as soon as we purchased it just like a boss we sent it straight to the shop well it is actually here so let's go ahead and check it out man i hope y'all like it bro open up this garage real quick and there she is man that thing is sexy as y'all can see we went ahead and put that facelift on there that robberies 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 i don't know how to pronounce it bro but hey it's on there man that big v8 and then of course in the front we got that big b on there man come on bro now i wanted to keep it stock for the most part because this is actually going to be like my everyday driver so that means i'll be pulling up to business affairs and you know all different type of things like that so i wanted to keep it stock for the most part so we kept the um stock rims on there and that uh red brake caliper that is actually uh stock as well so yeah man we driving in luxury but this is what life is all about that's what i really want this series to be about like and of course we got the dealership plates on there come on man Come on, man. When you own a dealership, man, that's just one of the perks. But anyways, this is what, you know, I want this series to be about, like, growth. Like, we make a business deal, then we go buy something. We sell a house, then we go buy something. We sell a car, then we go buy another. Like, you know, some realistic type stuff like that, man. But also, at the same time, keeping it, you know, fun because it is a video game. But, yeah, man, let's go ahead and head over to this Gucci store, man. Um, Actually, before we go... I got a little something that I want to try. I mean, I ain't going to say too much about it. We just going to try it. Now, honestly, bro, I think it might be some Reggie. We finna see what happened, man. Let's see what happened. Y'all know from our other series, we can get our hands on some pretty crazy stuff. Okay. Okay. We feeling good. We feeling good. Let me back out, man. Let me back out, man. We feeling pretty good. But like I said, I think it is some Reggie, bro, because that shit wore off fast as hell, man. So... Hey, y'all let me know where we can get that. Never mind, right? I ain't even gonna go there. <laughs> but yeah, man, we on our way to our Gucci, not our, but the Gucci, Gucci store. That would be dope if we did own a Gucci store. That would be hard as hell. So we're on our way there now. Um, also, guys, just a quick update, man. I got my tracking number yesterday, and that package will be delivered tomorrow evening. So this, I'll, I'll probably say maybe, because it's gonna take me a little bit to get everything set up. So i'll say maybe like two more streams not streams but videos with these graphics and then after that man we go on live stream we go on 4k every single video man so i'm super super excited i hope you guys are as well damn this bitch <laughs> this bitch get crazy like on these graphics they cool but i hate how the lights are so bright you, you see what i'm saying so we'll get all that fixed uh going you know going forward y'all just gotta bear with me man but yeah we're actually pulling up here to the gucci store of course we're gonna park up front man let me back up a little bit ain't trying to get no damn ticket that thing is sexy that thing is sexy man I f i'm starting to feel like it's kind of dangerous when you start to feel like like you made it because that's when you start to get comfortable man but when you walking out in the morning to one of these bad boys it's hard not to feel like that man oh let's go ahead and go inside man i'm tripping <laughs> But yeah, man, as y'all can see, we got the Gucci store in here, man. It's official Gucci, not none of that, no none of that off-brand off stuff. Let me walk inside real quick. Let's see. Ooh. Look, she got an attitude already. I ain't even made it all the way in here. That's crazy. But let me see what they got, man. Okay, of course they got the Gucci. Ooh, them Gucci. I think them may actually be my favorite Gucci shoes, bro. And they got the frames, of course, and the Gucci bag. I'm not really a handbag type dude, man. You got to forgive me. That's just not me, bro. Okay, they got the white Gucci shoes with the yellow frames. Okay, Gucci bag, Gucci bag, Gucci bag. Okay. Now, of course, they got the Gucci tees. 
Okay, some more Gucci bags. I'm trying to figure out what like style I want to go for tonight, bro. Like, should I go su suited and booted like an all white affair, like with the frames and like, or should I just go chill? You know, like a T, a Gucci T with just some jeans. Like, I don't know, bro. I don't know what I'm gonna do. But y'all see, you know, they they got a little bit of everything. They got the uh, sweater vest with the <laughs> with the shirt, man. They got the button ups. They got some more Gucci bags. Let me go check out these frames real quick. Okay, they got them red. I really like them red ones and them gold ones as well. Oh, them green ones down there is nice as hell too. Now, I'm not really feeling them yellow ones. I'm not even gonna lie to you, bro. But <laughs> hey, man, it's all good. And then over here, of course, they got all the shoes. I think my favorite pair of shoes, <clears throat> like I said, is these red ones right here. But I also like those white ones up there with the red and blue on them as well. So we got a few options, man. And then, of course, over there, they got the Gucci fragrances. So I'm super, super excited. Like I said, I'm going to talk to her and see. Look, bro, I don't even want to talk to her, man. Look how she's looking at me. But I guarantee you, as soon as I pull that black card out, everything is going to change, guys. See, I'm going to go ahead and find a fit for this, uh, for the festivities tonight. And I will see you guys in just a second. All right, guys. So we are finally done shopping, man. I got a, I got a few pieces, man. But I'll be honest, I wasn't really feeling anything in there. I mean, I picked up a little something for tonight, but I don't know if I'm gonna go back, man, until they get some new damn inventory. I spent a couple racks in there. I refuse to say how much I spent, man, because it ain't none of y'all damn business. No, I'm playing, man. We spent a little bit in there, but right now, man, I'm finna do, I'm finna do something, man. I don't know how I feel about, bro. Like. Like, bruh, so y'all know we own this car dealership, man. And first impression is everything. And at the car dealership, we got that big boy Wraith. Now, I mean, obviously, I got money and I can buy my own. But technically, we own one, but we don't own one. Like, I don't know if that makes sense. So basically, what I'm saying to y'all is this, bruh. I'm on the way to the car dealership, or our car dealership, to pick up the Wraith. And that is the car I'll be driving for tonight's date. Like, y'all let me know down below. Is that, is that cat, bruh? Am I... Am I, <laughs> am I full gazing for that? Like, let me know down below, man. Comment down below. But, hey, I mean, technically, we own it, bro. So, we actually going to leave our bins at the dealership. I mean, honestly, we could pull up in this. But, you know, a, 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 a bins is kind of more common than a Wraith, bro. So, we're going to leave this bad boy at the dealership. And we're going to take that Wraith. Um, I think the dealership. Yeah, there it is right there. And look. Look at the Wraith. It's just sitting there waiting on us, bro. That thing is so sexy, man. Um, yeah, we're gonna park this bad boy inside. I am not trying to have anything happen to our new car, bro. You go ahead and pull in. And also, too, I was reading in the comment section, man. Y'all got some good ideas when it comes to uh, what type of car we should actually add, like basically try to purchase to add into our dealership. Now, obviously, our bins is not for sale, but we just gonna park it right here for now while we hop out. Whew. Whew. It gonna hop into that wraith, man. Hey, bro, we finna, we finna. Well, I don't know. I was gonna say we gonna impress her tonight, but it ain't no telling who she been dealing with. But it don't matter, man. It don't matter, man. Don't get, don't get lost in the sauce, man. <laughs> but yeah, so now we got the wraith, guys. We got a few more errands to run before we, um, you know, get ready for our little shindig tonight. So right now we are going to head over to the office. Um, I want to show you guys a little bit, man. I've been putting in some work, bro. I've been putting in some work. Somebody commented and they was like, bro, just do, do some work off camera. So that's definitely what I've been doing, man. So we're going to head over there real quick. And then after that, we'll probably just head home and get dressed and get ready for the date, man. I'm super excited. So y'all stick around for that. Let me try to get out of here. Got to be careful in this thing. See, I hate how the lights are so damn bright. Like, the car is beautiful. Of course, we got the stars on the roof, man. We're going to see if we can get her in, in the rave. I know if we can get her in the rave, man, we're going to get us a second date. But, you know, we got to get her in there first, bro. She might, you know, want to meet us at the restaurant. It ain't no telling, man. But we're going to see. Oh, damn, I missed my turn. It's okay. I really need to get some food, too. And let me actually put my seatbelt on. When we do the live streams, I'm going to have y'all remind me, bro, to put that damn seatbelt on because I am not trying to fly through that windshield, <laughs> especially not on live, but that would be embarrassing as hell. Let's make this right. Yeah, I need to get some food, honestly. Um, let me see real quick at this red light. Where's the closest shop at? I got to keep an eye on my gas meter, too. I am not trying to run out of gas like we did last time. Uh, yeah, we ain't even got no... See, I guess we could probably go to this one, but is that too far? No, that's not too far out the way. We'll run up here real quick and grab us some food real quick, guys, before we get to the shop. Um, 
after this is after this episode is over i think i'm gonna actually go into my my 5m server and figure out how to add uh more food in there besides that that nasty ass burger and bottle of water man i wonder what else we should add in there bro y'all can see the festivities man getting ready for the <laughs> get ready for the holidays man they a little bit early but it's all good or maybe a little bit late i guess it's closer to last year's christmas than this year's christmas i think oh and that's the damn now we ain't gonna go <laughs> we ain't gonna go to the strip club to get nothing let me see i don't trust i don't trust that let me stop the car i'm just sliding in traffic all right y'all so we finally made it over to the gas station uh we are not in a very good area to be having a rave so we need to hurry the hell up and get out of here um i think i want to get some gas i don't even know if i want to put gas this gas in the rave bro i mean i don't know man i'm kind of one of them dudes that damn 33 dollars a gallon <laughs> well it's gonna be 38 for, or excuse me 36 for us because i'm going premium bro I'm kind of one of them dudes that, you know, I kind of, I'm real picky on where I get my gas from. But let's go ahead and get us some food real quick. I guess if we can eat here, we can get gas here. So let me get off that bougie shit, man. We'll grab us, we'll grab us just a little bit because we are going to dinner later. So we ain't got to go, you know, all the way out. That should be good. Oh, shit, I ain't mean to do that. Let me see. How much money we spend like, damn, that burger is literally $30. That should still blow my mind, man. But let's go ahead and indulge real quick, man. We'll have us a burger. And we'll have us some water. Damn, we was damn near finna be dehydrated, bro. And we'll have this last burger. Dude, that should do us good. All right, yeah, y'all, we feeling good, man. We feeling good. Let's go ahead and fill the rafe up real quick for tonight. Like I said, I'm real picky with my gas, but I guess if we can eat that nasty ass burger and that water from here we can probably get some gas from here man so let's see how much it's going to take i don't really know where the tank is at oh yeah it was almost empty actually i'm glad we stopped i'm thinking like 80 probably like 80 dollars bro it was on like one fourth so probably like nah it ain't gonna be 80 probably like 40 yeah it's gonna be like 40 dollars y'all let me see nah we didn't pass 40 let's see 60 $60 to fill up almost. Okay, okay, not bad, not bad, man. Let me see, yeah, let's go ahead and make our way over to our office real quick. We got a little bit of a drive, no big deal though. Like I said, this is not the best area to be driving the damn rave through. They probably think we YG or something. Slide on through here, man. But hey, bro, I, I, I've been trying not to. I've been trying not to listen to it, man, but did y'all hear that Fulio, bro, when I see you? Oh, my goodness, my G. Like, I try to stay away from, you know, I try to stay away from the negativity, but golly, my guy. Like, it's been stuck in my head for, like, the past two, three days. Like, bro went crazy, and, and at first, I kind of felt some type of way, but then again, I guess it was a response track, and then also, you got to remember that all is fair in love and war, like, when love is involved, and war, and war is, uh, you know, involved, man, all is fair, bro, so, <laughs> bro, <laughs> I've been cracking up, like, randomly throughout the day, I just catch myself, I catch myself, he was dissing on me, <laughs> I think it's a fool for that song, man. But I guess he had to do what he had to do. He was dissing on me. And God, no, I show sure can't sing, but that nigga definitely can't sing. But the crazy part about it is, it didn't sound bad at all. Like, I'm, I just like to think about the, like the mindset behind it, like the leading up to, like where he got the idea from, type shit. Like, oh my goodness, that shit was crazy, bro. That shit was crazy. <laughs> But yeah, man, we not too far away from the shop. I finally memorized my way, or the office. I finally memorized my um my way to the office. That way I ain't got to skip ahead no more. <laughs> I know that shit was getting irritating, but it's all good. Let me see what this thing will do, man. They go 100 on the dash. Hopefully they open the gates for us this time. I know. Oh, okay, we're going to slide in behind Buddy. We're going to slide right on in. I used to have to do this at my job, bro. We, uh, we used to have to pay, pay for parking in this parking garage. Like, literally 98% of the company, like, we use one person's badge and everybody will just drive out behind that one person. Like, <laughs> that 
that shit funny as hell, bro. We probably robbed them of a good, like, probably like $12,000, bro, by not paying for our parking. But um, I think we actually just gonna pull the Rafe in, man. Come on, bro. We're gonna go ahead and pull it in here, man. Why not? You know, big boss. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> That's what I'm saying, y'all. I'm starting to feel myself, man. I'm starting to feel like I made it, bro. I need to chill. But look at the way that bitch is shining. <laughs> All right, man. Let's go ahead and run in the office, man. <laughs> this nigga literally running in the office. <laughs> but yeah, man. We've been putting in some work, y'all. We've been putting in some work. Let me go ahead and tap in real quick. See what it's looking like. All right. As y'all can see, man, we have did 15 deliveries. We've earned our we've earned one hundred and ten thousand dollars, bro. So our total company, uh, the total amount our company has right now is one hundred and twenty thousand bucks. We also got two skill points, and we still, of course, have the one truck and one driver. So what I think we should do right now, honestly, bro, I'm kind of feeling like we should pay off these loans, bro. I'm I'm starting to feel like we should just go ahead and pay off these loans. As you can see, it is sixteen thousand six hundred dollars a piece. So once we pay those off, I think it'll allow us to take out a new loan, either fifty thousand, a hundred thousand, or four hundred thousand. Um, so I'll let y'all decide. Y'all comment down below: Should we just chill, or should we take out a new loan? But for right now, let's go ahead and pay these loans off real quick. Okay, that's one loan paid. Okay, okay, okay. Boom, and just like that, we paid off our two loans from the bank. So that will actually give us more credit. So we should be eligible, you know, for these other three loans. Uh, and of course, you know, by paying off those loans that did drop our total money in our company down to eighty six thousand eight hundred dollars. That's all good, man. No big deal. Now, we do have some skill points. Let's go ahead and check those out. Um, I already updated one. That was basically the product type. So we are able to, you know, haul explosives, gases, you know, all that good stuff. Or no, actually, we're just able to haul explosive right now. Uh, let me see what else we got in here. I think the number one thing we need to do right now is distance, bro. We need to do distance because that actually kind of uh, limits us from a lot of jobs. Because right now we could only go like six miles, I believe. So we'll go ahead and upgrade our distance real quick. Okay. So now what the hell? Now we only on 6.5. They gave us 0.5. Like what type of shit is that? I guess, man. That's crazy. I thought it was going to take us up. It. I don't know. And then I think we got one more skill point left. I think we should probably do valuable. Let me see. Okay. Unlock job. You get a 5% reward for valuable deliveries, 20% experience boost. Okay. Let's see what fragile looks like. 5%, 20%. Yeah, I think we're just going to go with valuable because I've seen a lot more of those than I have the fragile cargo job. So. We'll go ahead and upgrade that and that will actually put us on level one man so we are making moves as far as quick jobs like these are the valuable jobs so we would actually be eligible to do this one uh and not too many more man we got to keep working y'all but we making improvements man so we got our loans paid off we still got our driver of course uh let me check let me see of course we still need those new wheels but everything else on the truck is good like i said i'll probably upgrade the wheels probably around like 60 or 50 percent no worries no worries but yeah man we actually are making improvements bro i just want to go ahead and check in with y'all on this i think next next episode we'll spend some time at the shop i really been focusing all my business excuse me all my um attention on this business you know since we just got it started next episode we'll probably go back to the uh the car shop and start making plays and also, I think we'll probably go to an auction and buy us a new car next episode as well, y'all. So we are definitely making moves. But with that being said, I'm finna go ahead and head to the house, hop in the shower, bro. Get my dirty ass cleaned up, man. Uh, I think the I think the Rafe is clean, man. It's shining, bro. We ain't even gotta take that bad boy to the cleaners, not the cleaners. I'm tripping, bro. <laughs> to the car wash. So yeah, I think we just finna go ahead and head home. Uh, get cleaned up and, and get ready for this date guys. I will see you there um, And also like I said, just do me a favor after the date comment down below if we should go on date number two or hey man We might we might end up on date number five tonight, you know get her back to the crib man So y'all do me a favor comment down below and I will see you shortly all right, guys, so I thought we were just gonna go to dinner, but she switched it up last minute and she liked to catch a movie instead. So I actually just threw on, you know, something simple, just the Gucci loafers with the fitted slacks and the Gucci belt. On top of that, I decided to go with the Gucci premium polo and the Cartier frames. Now guys, you know your fragrance is most important, so I just went with the Creed Cologne. You know, I'm feeling good, I'm looking good. 
hey man tonight's gonna be a good night but since i'm already running late i will fill you guys in on what happened at the beginning of the next episode go ahead and smack that subscribe button and i'll see you next time